Then ningetaka nichukue nafasi hii kumuomba kwa heshima mtusaidie on laws on alcohol to be able to regulate what is happening in the counties. Sadly, most of our governors and the CECs have licensed almost everybody in the counties, making life almost impossible for our people, isn't it? So, tunataka mutusaidie, you tighten the laws, and I want to thank those who have already done so, the county of Nyandarwa, I think Meru Alipitisha Juzi, na wale wengine tafadhali, assist us so that we can work together na tutafaulu tukifanya kazi pamoja. Your Excellency, hii ni jeshi yako ya mashinani. And by you according time to listen to them, you have done the right thing. These are our foot soldiers on a daily basis. And many a time we empathize with them because ya ile kazi wako na yo pale mashinani, and they, are, they don't leave their homes. Na most of their homes have no gate. Wanainchi wanaja pale. And therefore, by listening to them to try to give them dignity, wakiongoza, raisi ni kitu ya maana. Mimi mwenyewe ni kieda nyumbani hata siku mbili. I have to run away the third day because I cannot cope with the pressure ambaye hiko pale mashinani. So mimi niombe nyinyi muendele kumshikilia rais kwa kueleza program ambaye anaendeleza. And let me confirm to you as the principal assistant to the president tuliingia tukakuta wakati mngumu. I know raia wamekuwa a little bit impatient because of the economic challenges. But I want to confirm to you that the president has put in hard work for the last one and a half years. And he has kept us on our toes. The days here start as early as 5 a.m., sometimes past midnight. And all the positive indicators, Munaona, ya economic recovery, it is not just happening. It is pure hard work by the president na sisi tukimusaidia. Kwa hivyo, mutushikilie mashinani, zile program ziko, musipigie debe, na mutembe na kifua mbele, mukiwa na hakikisho ya kwamba mbele iko sawa.